Alright, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video. We are just taking a quick look at Veracity here and as we can see, looking as though we are still chopping it up in and around this area here after that big rollover that we did see in the market. It did look as though someone dropped a huge bag of Veracity on the market because it did go down pretty much instantaneously, didn't it? If I put this on auto here, you'll be able to see what happened. Basically, in the, in the space of about a minute, the price absolutely tanked here, didn't it? At around, what is this, at 7 cents? All the way down to around... It dropped a full 0.2 of a cent, which is insane, really, isn't it? That's a massive drop in such a small time. Maybe loads of liquidations contributed to this as well, but you can obviously see on the hourly what's going on here. Basically, that we've been having this coil motion, didn't we? We've got the breakout back test, back test, back test, but we lost support, retested, massive rollover in conjunction with this losing this swing low here. And a huge, this huge capitulation. It got bought up really nicely though. And then you can see here a little bit of a rally. And now really just going sideways and consolidating. Before figuring out what's going to happen next. I think realistically, as I've been saying for literally weeks now. Veracity was due to have a bit of a correction. And I think this is perfectly healthy. And definitely good for the price action in my opinion. You can see very clearly here. Massive parabolic move. Followed by this overextension. Which is kind of grinding the price action out really. Big bearish divergence is coming in, and we did say you'd probably see a correction fairly soon. And that I would be looking for that, really. I want that to happen because it means that you can have a more extended rally to the upside for Veracity if that is the case. You can see it very, very clearly on the charts here. Massive, massive move. It's like a hockey stick, isn't it? Just parabolic beyond comprehension, really. And then you can see here, coiling up, overextension, and then getting stuck under that one dollar, that uh, one cent, sorry extremely big psychological target it's around a 5x from this low to there people taking profits and then you can see here coming back down starting to back test some levels i've got a, a small long position entered here and a second long position entered here i've got a much larger long position down at the 023 as well if we do continue to retrace like this and then bounce but right now i think veracity is you know it's had a, a big move an overextension, a come down. We've back tested this area right now, and we are holding it as support still, aren't we? So you could see a bounce here, or maybe you know a further consolidation, back test, and then a bounce here. But I do think now that Veracity is broken out of that big bear market resistance like this, you know anywhere above this resistance really is still golden in my opinion. We could come all the way back down to here and bounce, and that would still be positive in my opinion because he'd be making a higher high, higher low, and then probably come up and make that next higher high. If we do see a bullish market coming back into play. So not that much to say today guys. Other than the fact that we are just consolidating. Going sideways and basically waiting for our next move to the upside in my opinion. So that will be it for today guys. I am keeping the video short and sweet. So thank you very much for watching as always. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. And if you do want to support the channel, please do consider becoming a YouTube member by clicking the join button down below. You'll get access to our private Discord where you can hang out with us and also other investors just talking about where cryptocurrency is going in the future. So if you do want to support the channel, that would be a good way to do so. And I will see you in the next video.